Hello everyone. In this short video, we are going to discuss differences between hexokinase and glucokinase. If you want to download the lecture notes, if you want to give the online quiz, and if you want to have one-to-one -one interaction with me, then download the Nexus app. Link is given in the description box. So let's start. So first, we will see what is the function of this hexokinase and glucokinase. So we all know that first step of the glycolysis. In the first step of the glycolysis, this glucose is phosphorylated into the glucose 6-phosphate and this particular irreversible step is catalyzed by the hexokinase as well as the glucokinase. Hexokinase will catalyze this step particularly in all the tissues, specifically in the muscle, while glucokinase will catalyze this step only in the liver. That is the function of this hexokinase and glucokinase. Now we will see what are the differences between these two enzymes. The first difference is related to the distribution. So this hexokinase is located in the all the tissues. Fine, in the all tissues it will convert glucose into glucose 6-phosphate. While this glucokinase is specifically located in the liver as well as in the beta cells of pancreas. That is the first major difference. Second difference is this hexokinase, it has got high affinity for the glucose. That means it will have a low Km value and low Vmax value. And this glucokinase, it has got low affinity for the glucose. That means it will have a high Km value and high Vmax value. And this hexokinase, as the name suggests, it will act on the hexoses, that is glucose, fructose and mannose. While this glucokinase will specifically act only on the glucose. And this hexokinase, it will be not induced by insulin. This hexokinase will not be induced by insulin while this glucokinase is induced by insulin. Insulin can stimulate the action of this glucokinase. Then this hexokinase, it will act at the low blood glucose level while this glucokinase will act only when the blood glucose level is greater than 100 mg per deciliter. That means this glucokinase is going to regulate the blood glucose level. And this hexokinase is inhibited by its end product that is glucose 6-phosphate while this glucokinase is not inhibited by its end product that is glucose 6-phosphate. So these are the some major differences between hexokinase and glucokinase. Thank you for watching. Thank you.